We are building the worst NBA guard with current NBA players. Let's start with athleticism. No, on the bottom. I just need to know if this guy's still in the league real quick, guys. Hold on one second. You can't finish? I I can finish. I have my profession, but he's not in the NBA anymore. Yeah, I did too, but he's Brandon Brandon Knight. Brandon Knight. Yeah! Look, look. Yeah, he I was trying to scroll last, down and yeah, show his last looked. game. I already looked. All right, so let's start with athleticism. Who we got for athleticism, boys? The most unathletic? Yep. What do we, like? Guards. Point guard. Point guard, shooting guard. Shooting guard. Okay, point guard, shooting guard. Ones and guard. Twos. Um, throw something out. I got a couple names, so you guys go ahead and throw some stuff out. Athleticism. Let's go. I got Luca on there. <sighs> Yeah, Luca's one. I'm trying to think of an old ass guard right now. That's our boy, Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry, dude, I like that I mean, telepathy. We, we got Kyle Lowry in there, dude. I like that on. dude. Those are the only two names. I, I think have. he's. I mean, he can't dunk anymore. I've never seen him. Could dunk. he? I don't. Probably. I don't think I've ever seen him. Dunk. I hope. So. I'm sure he could. I hope so. Like, <laughs> I've never seen him dunk. But you've seen Luca dunk. So who is Luca? Is also six six. Kyle Lowry's like six foot. I mean, it still helps. I wish this was. Wasn't current. We could go Paul Pierce. Oh boy! Yeah, it's only current. So yeah, we can do all time. Who do we think is uh, least athletic? Le- less athletic. Kyle. I, I think Kyle's least guy. athletic out of all those. Okay. I was trying to think of other old ass guards, but I can't think of any. Chris Paul is like another old guard, but but he's like shifty and shit. I still. would take Kyle Lowry over him as far as being less athletic. Yep. All right. So Clay for Thompson. athleticism, we got. He's so after the after the ACL. Clay is he's definitely not athletic. He lost a lot of it. So we want to go with Kyle Lowry for athleticism. Yeah. All right. Cool. Clutch. We got a name for it, but you guys go ahead and throw some stuff out. Wait. This was on. a hard one. I gotta see this, if somebody is still in the league real quick. I feel I like might have you guys. So I on. I did no research for this. Nothing. God damn. I you feel guys. like off of one play, you have to give it. We're here. We're here to Russell Westbrook. Oh no, we're not here. One, when mine he is because puts of one up play. the shot and Kawhi just goes to his knees immediately, <laughs> bro. That is the most unclutch shit ever. He's like, God, damn. like so, the shot is up and Kawhi is just like, damn it. So I have one name because of one moment too, and I thought we were going to the same place for clutch. He is listed as a point guard technically, even though he's six <laughs> ten. I have Ben Simmons. Ben Simmons. I mean, that one play under the hoop, yeah, all bro. he had to do was dunk it, bro. And that game is one, like. That one play. I don't mind Ben Simmons. I mean, we've seen <laughs> Russell Westbrook hit clutch shots in the past. Is so there I think a durability that's section? Because Ben Simmons can go there instead. Oh, my God. So, <laughs> he could go for uh, for durability. If we my had headset that. fell off. That was, that was squeaky as hell over there. <laughs> so, we going Ben for clutch? Yeah, we'll do Ben for clutch. I mean, I you been, ain't going to choose him to shoot a game-winning three or mid-range. So, right. he's only clutch. forced to do something else. What about defense? So do we want defense as a whole or do like oh, the interior? Yeah, let's do it as a whole because oh, they don't oh, go they. interior that often. I mean, like there's it's, only like it's guard, two, three right? guards. Because when we built up. the guard, we had, I think, Smart Drew Holiday, Smart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dort. Holiday, yeah. Like we had those yeah. dudes because we did perimeter and interior. Yeah. Um, um, I mean, we can do but, interior, but. I mean, I already have the graphic with perimeter and interior already up. So okay, well we could. I mean, do that. I didn't the, do. Uh, okay, well I have two guys. Just we think just of a one. little last point guard to play the interior. Chris Dunn. Well, I'll throw my names <laughs> out. Um, I have Bones Highland for perimeter D. He literally got traded because the GM said we can't have two guys who don't play defense, and they chose Michael Porter Jr. over him. Yeah, you can put him anywhere actually, so, perimeter or interior. And then I have IT Isaiah Thomas. Yeah, yeah he can't guard a traffic cone. Is he still? And if you put him under interior, contract, that's that's terrible. So those are the two names I got. If you guys want to throw anybody in now, I'm there. good with that. I'm cool with it. All right, playmakers. <laughs> Who do you think of as a guard? Is just a terrible playmaker. Like, cause playmaking is also you know getting other people involved, being able to hit a little pick and roll. You know, maybe hit the roller. Um, I got one guy for this, but I don't know if you guys got any people you want to throw out. Um, I can't think of one right now. I had trouble trying to think. Give me. I got a guy that's just strictly about buckets. He don't care about passing. He don't care about getting nobody involved. He actually got in trouble in summer league by Steve Nash because he didn't pass. I got my guy Cam Thomas from the Brooklyn Nets. Yeah, Cam I mean Thomas he's just a bucket. Buckets. Yeah, he's he's another version of Michael Porter. <laughs> he does average two point nine assists per game, but 
he don't care about passing the ball. He is Those all are about, accidental assists. Yeah, he's just all about it. It's a double team. Like, ah, hit yeah. somebody and they made an open shot. Yeah. But I got Cam Thomas, right? All he cares about is just buckets. I'm not mad at it. I'm cool with the Cam Since Thomas. Since we're doing guards, couldn't you throw in like a two that's just a strictly run and gun two? Yeah, 100%. You could throw like uh, Derek Bogdanovich in there. I don't think I've ever seen him like be a playmaker. All I've seen is him just shoot. Yeah. <laughs> like, I've never seen him do anything other than shoot threes. So Thanks. like he could have been there. Facts. I almost put Jordan Clarkson, but I'm like, no, nah, I think he averages like a good amount of assists yeah, this year. Yeah, he does too. But he's another dude just buckets. Straight. Um, buckets. So we want to move to dribbling? It's not Kyrie Irving. I got, I got a guy for this too. It's the opposite end of the spectrum. <laughs> All right, so who can you think of that's a guard that just handles or just weak? Jalen Brown, don't ever go left. That's who I got on my list. Uh, I got Jalen Brown. Oh there has to be a God. worse dude. We can literally His make it funny and terrible, just put Jalen Brown's left hand. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> Jalen Brown's left hand. I mean, we've seen my dude on the sideline watching them scrimmage, and he moves the ball to his left and just drops it after that. Like, ah, I hit my foot. Like, <laughs> Like Jalen Brown goes left, hand left is and turns into a, an accountant, bro. It, he's bouncing off his foot, defender's feet, everything. <laughs> um, all right, three point shooting. So this one, if you can think of someone God else for clutch, ben Simmons. ben Simmons is a pretty damn good so shooter for I had the three him, point. But I couldn't think of anybody for clutch. That's the only reason why I moved him. But I do have a guy. Um, you guys might not remember him, but I threw out Johnny Davis for uh, three point shooting. He is still uh, league. Uh, yes, he is still in the league. He plays for the Wizards. Um, he shot 28% from three his rookie year, and then he shot like 32% the following year. So he's like career average, like 30% three-point shooter, which isn't terrible. But 28% is pretty bad for a guard. But you can look up who has the worst three-point percentage as a guard and see like if you want to go with them. But I threw Johnny Davis out there. He hit the Markel Fultz where he just like forgot how to shoot. I feel like Chris Paul's whole career has kind of been like a dude. Chris, we should put Chris Paul for a clutch. That can't can never get it done. <laughs> he's been like hated for never being able to hit threes. Really, I know he's like, he's a he's a mid range god. But Chris Paul's got some probably he's probably got some games where like you're looking like damn Chris probably eight three. I feel, yeah, I feel like his percentage probably isn't bad, but like he don't shoot a lot. I feel of them like either. the joke is always like Chris Paul can't shoot a three. He's a pick and roll mid range god. That's what he does. Like. Goes to that, uh, that elbow, fade away, fade and right, knock down every time. Um, what you got over there, Derek? I see you squinting. I'm researching. You're looking like Zhang Wei Li. <sighs> hey, take that out the video. <laughs> <laughs> take that out the video, please. Um, I was just looking at metrics. Cade Cunningham, not that clutch, I guess. Really? According to clutch statistics. It's crazy they have him as a point guard. Um. Keldon Johnson is a forward and guard slash guard. But, yeah, he's a two guard technically. Um, Don't do my boy. Calvin Cole like Anthony that. is on there. Is he? Um, Clay Thompson's kind of low on here. What for clutch? Yeah. The only reason I didn't say Clay is because people are going to be like, "You go forget about Game Six, Clay." Yeah. Like yeah. I already knew that was going to come, so I didn't even think about nah, putting dude, his name. Put Clay in there. I bet on the Warriors. Like, <laughs> well, there was like four or five games left in the him. season. They kicked it around. Clay, three, buzzer beater. Ah. Break. Completely. I think he airball. There was that graphic of him, and it was like when you get an A on a group project, you didn't do shit, and he's just sitting on the bench smiling because he had like like eight points that game or something crazy like that. We can go whatever um, you said. Um, so repeat kind of what you said, and then. You guys are going to get me flamed. Um, for three point, I got Johnny Davis. And unless you want to switch Ben Simmons there and Chris Paul to clutch. Do we want to put Chris Paul to clutch? Chris oh, Paul to clutch might be nasty work. <sighs> I mean, I'm okay with that. Did that Matt was, say nah, bro, when he was the one that suggested it? I think he was like saying, ah, I, I, just like, yeah, I don't care. Oh, I thought he said nah, bro. Russ at three-pointers? Oh, my God. Mm. Yeah. Russ is a horrible three-point yeah, shooter. Yeah, he really is. Oh, my God. Russ, yes. Take Johnny Davis out. Russ is, yes. Dude, he's shooting 27.3% from three. A whole career 30%. Yeah, Russ. I, I looked it up. It's oh, you random. know who else? Who? Bruce Brown. He don't shoot Bruce. whatsoever. You think Brucey be going somewhere? Hell no. <laughs> My franchise, he'd be going crazy. Shut up. Anyways. All right, for three-pointers, we got Russell Wilson. 
Westbrook. <laughs> earlier. As soon as I said it, I was like, that's not who I meant. Yeah. Russell Westbrook. <laughs> My bad. For what? <laughs> three pointers. Okay. Worst three point shooting guard. He has the worst three point percentage when attempting 3,000 plus three pointers. Oh my God. Worst in NBA history. Make sure you add that fact in. Jerry Stackhouse is right below him, though. Because when cats uh, come at me for that. And AI. And Gary Payton. What about mid range? This is a tough one. Because mid range, like not a lot of people shoot mid range jump shots unless they're like bigs. Yeah. Guards are usually three or layup. Can we just put Ben Simmons here? We can't just put Ben Simmons everywhere. We already yeah, used no. him. Ben Simmons ain't, is he used? Yeah. Yeah, clutch. for clutch. We um, didn't put Chris Paul at clutch. Mid-range was a tough one. I have Gary Payton a second just because he can't shoot. I, he, I mean, Fine, might as well. That, <laughs> I got to go. He can't shoot. So. Yeah, yeah, I got Gary Payton a second for that. But I've got nobody for finishing, so you guys got to think about that one. That's the only one I couldn't figure out somebody for. Chris Paul. Chris Paul's a good finisher, though. Yeah, he, he is. I was thinking about just dunking. Why are you hating on Chris Paul, bro? Because <laughs> I said it, and that's the only dude he could think of. Um, you gotta. It's hard because that's what guards are supposed to be able to do. Patrick like Beverly, <laughs> cut in and go crazy. I mean, all right, Patrick Pat Beverly. Bev. I've seen him smoke a lot of layups. Because I'm trying to think, like, who have I seen to smoke mad layups besides Brandon Knight? I was going to say, is Brandon Knight still in the league? No, bro, he's in the Euro <laughs> League. Me and Matt, I already looked him up this morning, too. That's crazy, though, because me and Matt were really right there. It's got to be Patrick Beverly, dude. Look, Matt, I read it right before Cam Thomas. Brandon Knight. <laughs> Patrick Beverly's not a bad one. Yeah, I got nobody for uh, finishing. Like, this is a tough one. I'm trying to, because I don't want to take, like, a dude that's on the bench. You know what, what I mean? What about a dude that just is a shooter? And not a uh, Bogdan. No, he can finish. Not a finisher. Like I was gonna say, I've seen Bogdan dunk. Yeah. How often have we seen Clay really finish? Ah, Clay, Clay can, can finish. finish. Clay can finish. He can. Yeah, this is a tough one. AJ Green on the Milwaukee Bucks. I don't even know who that is. Exactly. Dennis Schroeder. I, yeah, this one I really don't know. This one's hard. Maybe we should go with Pat Bev. <laughs> Yeah, I think Pat Bev's just because he the- sucks and people are gonna, they're not gonna be mad at it. And for finishing, we've got Pat Bev. So you want to run him down? Yeah. You want me to run it down, or you want to run it down? I'll run it down. Okay. Barbershop break rooms, worst possible guard. Go. You don't gotta actually add that in. I was just. I was adding it in because it was on you. Damn. Finishing Pat Bev, mid range Gary Payton, three point Russ Westbrook. Dribbling, Jalen Brown's left hand, specifically. Playmaking, Cam Thomas, perimeter, D-Bones Highland. Interior defense, Isaiah Thomas. Clutch, Ben Simmons. And athleticism, that big ass, Kyle Lowry. Kyle Lowry, thick boy. 